Second old show. What up? All right. Uh, let's see where I'm going with this. Mr. Cat Williams. Okay. First of all, let me say this. Like, for real, I'm a huge fan. I think he's one of the best to do stand-up comedy. I was really happy when he won an Emmy. Um, I believe he deserved that. He's worked hard in this game. He's put a lot of work in. He's opened up a lot of doors for a lot of us. And, um, you know, I appreciate that. But this is where it gets weird at, right? These, these little weird disses. First of all, let me say this. Everybody that listens to him and take what he says seriously, stop. <laughs> as much as y'all love to get on Kanye and talk about everybody else and mental illness, y'all can obviously see that something is wrong. First of all, he's saying things that's not true. And y'all keep listening to this stuff. He's literally saying things that are not true. Now, I get it. Cat does have a great delivery because he has this matter of fact voice like, yeah, I'm going to tell you this now. Hollywood don't like me because I have long hair and I'm a real neck. Now, shut your dumb ass up. Netflix, that's how the Netflix deal go. You sell a million tickets, they offer you a million. That's not true. None of this shit is true. <laughs> None of it. And y'all keep listening to this dude. Okay, you keep talking about I ain't a movie star, whatever, because I, I don't know how to kiss a chick, I'm ugly. I don't know. First of all, ladies, just, let's just really think about this. I'm being straight up honest. If you took me and Kat from when we, before we ever had any money, I'm going to say this. This is a little real with no money. Skinny, fade, glasses. Cat Williams with no money. The long hair and no f***ing teeth. Who you going to pick? I'll be down in a second. I'm at work, so I have to go down because I'm shooting it. I have, a, I have a television show that I've earned now. I write and I produce and I star in. But I'm just tired of, stop listening to this clown. Bro, like, and this is another thing. Cat, whatever you want to say to me, come say. I saw Cat Williams at the Emmys, and I saw him the day after that at a Dave Chappelle party. The man didn't say one thing to me. Not one word. And you keep making these weird ass videos. Stop it. Look, at the end of the day, this is what I never understand. These guys put themselves in a position to open up doors for all of us to walk through this. So where it's a little easier of a route. And then once we walk through the door, now you're upset. That doesn't make sense. And that's divisive. Grow the fuck up. Making diss videos? Call me. Text me, FaceTime, whatever you want. We can, we, I'm only doing, you know what I'm doing this? And I'm going to get off because I go to work. I'm only doing this because when I see you again, I'm actually going to say something. So now that I made this video, it's opened the door for me to be like, hey, whatever I've said here, I'm going to say to you. And this ain't no fight shit. I don't want to fight shit. I just want to talk. What's up? We keep talking about what's a movie star and all this other shit. Like, what the my breakout role was in an Oscar-nominated film called Get Out, which could have went either way. Either motherfuckers loved the shit, which they did, or hate us for killing all those white people and drive it off. That's the character I played picked up my friend from a crazy situation. That was my breakout character. Your breakout character was a pimp. Huh? Trying to get fucked by niggas just got out of jail. That's your claim to fucking fame. Pimp, a gimmick? You are a gimmick. The reason why you're still in this game is because nobody takes you fucking serious. That's right. Nobody does. Nobody. Why do you think a little boy can whoop your ass and everybody still buy tickets to your show? Because you're entertaining. You're kind of like Donald Trump. you the Trump. And it's sad because it's people supporting you instead of fucking talking to you. You got the most is that open for you? All oh, that shit. Ain't nobody saying real shit to you. Stop it. It's divisive. Grow the f up, little. Now, if you got some shit to say to me, come talk to me, bruh. I've earned everything I got. I did everything you're supposed to do in this game. I was new faces at Laugh Palooza. I was new faces at Just for Laughs. I did Comic View. I did Who Got Jokes. I did Bad Boys of Comedy. I did all the, the, the Comedy Central shows. I did the HBO. 
I did everything from the chitless circuit to the mainstream shit. Every fucking comedic step you take. This is the result of that. This. Because I worked this shit for 20 years. Earned this shit. I wasn't no Ice Cube movie. That's how I got on, motherfucker. I'm from Chicago. I've been cool. I ain't said shit. If you got something to say to me, hey, look, hit me up. I'll get you a drive on, on the lot, nigga. You come in my office and come talk to me. My office. On the Fox lot. What are you talking about? Corny ass bitch.